Hi, I'm Scott Campbell. Welcome to my window painting tutorials. Lesson 95, Bee Bug Butterfly. Good morning. Hi. Is Angela here? Yeah. Oh, great. Oh, hi. How are you? Good. How are you doing? Good. So what did you want to do? Uh, Everything or a little bit? <laughs> um, there's a lot of windows. Um, yeah, these are good on the side. I don't... I'm not sure about this side. If yeah, that's already there. Because there's a tree there and yeah. some things that kind of block. So, I agree. So maybe just this one little side and then the front. Okay. All right. So do you want to do um, anything specific or do you want to say specific things well, like strawberries? Well, in the springtime, we, we do um, feature berries, strawberry, mostly strawberries. So, so do you want to have them. any words that say strawberry shakes and sundaes or just put... Well, not, not quite yet because we don't have them now. So if just I, have pictures of yeah. them. Yeah, if I put them up, it's going to be... <laughs> so show, maybe show a strawberry shake and strawberries? Yeah, But not the springtime the, and stuff. And more spring, not so much strawberries. Yeah. Okay. Well, I always start with the, the featured character. So I'm going to do a bee. And I envision him being out here and kind of flying in, holding the strawberry, shaking his hand. And then over here, this part. So it's gonna be like a big wave here. So this is the motion line gonna come down here. All right, I got Mr. Buzzy B all laid out with his strawberry shake. I think on this side, I wanna do a big leaf, like a big plant coming out here. And then a big leaf with a bug on it. Some big giant leaves. So over here I got my uh, bug on a leaf and I got my uh, typical cute spring butterfly. <laughs> okay I got all my main characters in, all my uh, all my base coats. I got this strawberry flying through the air and this daffodil I've kind of become attracted to. I've been using him a lot and then also this uh, I'm gonna have this flower over here near the entrance saying welcome to Burgerville. So with all the white done, now I'm just gonna come in and lay out the green. I follow the line kind of around the bee, almost on the same wave. I wanna start doing some of these bigger leaves here. And this green is formulated so I can get away with one coat, because it does have some white in it. Now when you have these spaces like this, you take advantage of them, and this is where you can uh, put, some, put some grass. And notice I make them different sizes. This one's a little thicker because you want variety. It's so nice to have managers like Angela who kind of just let me do my thing. And uh, they end up getting more for their money. <laughs> well, I've got, uh, I've got all the green done now. The green goes pretty fast. And then I'll come back in with the dark green and the light green like on the other uh, videos you saw. What you making? Grass? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna do that board. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> You're like, man, someone else is doing arts and crafts, not just me. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, start on the second coat of uh, of white and let this green dry. Alright, the sun uh, sun's really coming out now. It feels great, and I got the second coat done on all this. So while that's drying, I'm going to go ahead and put some dark green and light green in. I decided to make a, a highlight green that's really, really, really bright, but still I've got a lot of white in it too. So it's saturated, but it should make a, a beautiful, really cartoony highlight for the green grass. This is kind of different. I came in with my roller. I had a blend and sort of did part of the wings and then I came back in with a with just a brush and did a little wet on wet thing so it's pretty cool. Here I'm doing the strawberry shake again and uh, as you've seen on other stores and I just I leave a white uh, white area around the edge and uh, that kind of gives 
a suggestion that it's a clear container. And you can see inside. This is kind of a new thing I'm doing on the shakes in the clear cups. Because uh, I'm starting to blend them down. It kind of creates more of a, a feeling of volume. And also it's like a highlight on the clear cup itself. I used to just do some quick stuff, but this little bit of blending goes a long way. What's that? I went from digging pictures. <laughs> oh, pictures of the art. Yeah. Yeah, it's not quite done yet, but I'm sure she'll be out again with the camera. Yeah, I just got to trap it in black now. All right, the fun part. <laughs> Get to do the black. All right, I got it all wrapped up. I'm not sure what time it is, but I'll check on it. Butterfly's cute, the little blue bug came out good. And then over here, this is the main character. He came out pretty good. Hey everybody, my name's Buzzy the Bee. And oh, I got a strawberry shake. Wouldn't you just love to have one of them? <laughs> oh, I got a drip right there. I'll have to touch that up. And then I just finished this over here the extremely happy strawberry. I don't know why he's so happy because he's going to get blended into a shake. So <laughs> anyway, that's it for the day. What's that? It's very cute. Oh, very thank nice. you. I'm glad you like it. Oh, we love it. It's beautiful. Thanks. It's always fun when people comment. All right. Well, signing off from Burgerville.